This freedom is lost. Okay, okay, all right. So he said, of the tribe of Judah, we see 12,000. So Joe Biden letting you know straight up. The 12,000 of the Jew, we won't let that happen. We will make sure that we do everything to carry loose, to carry short. All right? All right? Let's jump. What does he want? Of the tribe of Reuben, we see 12,000 of the tribe. So he doesn't want to get that. Get it like, you know, the brother, the other tribe, like Northern Kingdom get. He didn't want them to be sealed, man. That's why he see, kept some of our people in the reservation camps. Like you got Northern Kingdom that don't have access to water. Northern Kingdom that ain't not willing, man. I'm able to put up this, man. I'm going to bring it out too. Northern Kingdom, right? Northern Kingdom in this state, they don't have access to water. Water. I'm taking drink, drinkable water. They don't have access to it. Meanwhile, he take 800 million, all right, of the tax paying money. Instead of building wealth for this brother of our people that they set up in those areas and abandon them over there so that they can die and suffer and die. Instead of giving them the proper resources after they pillage and stole the, 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 the land, everything that belonged to them, instead of helping these people, providing them the, the least thing that they need, no, they still continue to take the money. That's what we tell you, man. Esau, he's all about his money. Because this guy right here, he got his business in, in Ukraine with his son. Joe Biden, he's making his money. All that you see on it is all for his interest. Whatever money he send over there, he get his percentage. Believe me or not. The bank, at the end of the day, he's going to get his commission. Believe me or not. Because he's the one for, for fooling it, right? Guess what? He'll get his commission. He ain't doing just for fun. He already gave his commission, maybe 3%, 1%, 5%, 10%, 0.5%. He's going to get his commission, man. This is capitalism. You got to remember, it's all capitalism. It's all about money, right? It's all about how many people they can sell, how much money they can make of you or me. It's pretty simple, man. So he doesn't want us to be saved. He said, of the tribe of Asher, we see 12,000. Keep in mind. Okay, of the tribe of Nephtali, we see 12,000. Of the tribe of Manasseh, we see 12,000. Now you got to keep in mind. Manasseh, right? You, you got to keep in mind. When you read Manasseh and uh, uh, Ephraim, they make up one tribe. Keep in mind. Because they're sitting in the seat of their father, Joseph. Keep in mind. Joseph is split into two. So Joseph is going to get 6,000 from Ephraim and 6,000 from Manasseh. Keep in mind. You see, 12 tribes is not 13 tribes. Like some brothers say 13. I don't believe in that. I believe in 12 tribes. Okay, because Joseph still received 12,000. So 6,000 is going to go to Ephraim and 6,000 go to who? To who? To Manasseh. So keep in mind, all right? The only tribe that is missing when you read throughout here is who? The tribe of Dan, the Danite. The Danite that's still getting the 12,000. Don't get it twisted. Don't let no brother somebody tell you where they lost. No. Dan is still part of the 12 tribes. Keep in mind. The then I see part of the 12 tribes. Okay. Then you see part of the 12 tribes. They're still going to receive the 12,000. So keep in mind. So you got 12,000 times 12 tribes is 144,000. So all the same, he want to send what, how many? Let's go right here. He said, of the tribe of Simeon will see 12,000. Of the tribe of Levi will see 12,000. Of the tribe of Issachar will see 12,000. Of the tribe of Zabulon will see 12,000. Of the tribe of Joseph will see 12,000. Of the tribe of Benjamin will see 12,000. Keep in mind. So he's literally blasphemy against the Most High. Right? Pharaoh. The King Pharaoh. The King Pharaoh is, is blasphemy against the Most High, man. And 144,000 rounds of ammunition. There we go. go. With those howitzers, it also includes more tactical drones. More tactical drone. You see that? 144,000. When I saw this, this is this is what I sent the, the the brother straight, right? This is what I sent to the, the brother straight, straight up to the point. Today, right. I'm announcing another 800 million dollars to further augment Ukraine's ability to. Right. When I saw it, this is what I sent the brother, man. You know. 144,000. There we go. Boomba. 144,000. From who? He's telling you, no. He's letting you know. Esau is letting you. He said, you know what? We know about 144,000. We don't want that to happen. All right? They don't want Mashiach to return. They don't want you to be saved. That's why they set up this cool lady, right? Wicked cool lady, right? Talking about he, you know, he got nominated in justice, blah, blah, blah. All this. And then guess what? The whole agenda is to target the Hebrew Israelite. The whole game is to target the brother that. Now we realize some of you came, 
You try and detach yourself from your brother. We see that. We, we see a lot of you. Yeah, some of you say you are not affiliated with this group. Right? Oh, really? So you are not. That means you're scared to go through persecution pretty much, right? Pretty much that's what we get from it. Why are you trying to dissociate your, yourself from your own people? Why are you doing that? Why? Where we are not affiliated with blah, 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 blah. This is, man, come on, man. Where in the Bible did Paul did that? Did Paul say he separated himself? Didn't Paul say there's no Jew, no Greeks? Right? Didn't Paul say that? All the same, we see you. Some of you making videos, you design your, your page look good. You'll be like, well, we are not affiliated with any group, blah, blah. So you're separating yourself because you don't belong to these camps, right? Then they can become your enemy. That's what we see from a lot of you out there, man. Because the brother don't belong to that camp, then the bro brother become your enemy. What is that in the scripture, man? Even though you don't agree with one another, right? Even though, Shalom King, even though you don't agree with one another, guess what? Show brother love, man. Right? Or oh, where well, we are not associated with this camp, we are not, no. Listen, you know what you're doing? You're going against Amashia when you do stuff like that. Literally, believe me. You go against a much cause where the, the brother belongs to the other camps, then you belong to this camp, then the brother is your enemy. No, man. That's the spirit of the Most High. And Esau is happy. Meanwhile, you're sleeping. Esau is telling you, you know what? The 144,000 mentioned in the Bible, we're going to use it. Right? We're going to use it. Esau literally telling you. You see, Esau, Esau is not sleeping. We're sleeping. Esau is, is plotting. He's telling you all those propaganda you see on the TV talking about Ukraine, blah, blah, blah. Listen, it's all about the destruction of the Hebrew Israel. Like, wake up. Wake up. This is getting serious. Famine is in the corner. Get ready. Okay? A lot of people ain't ready for this thing. You got to be ready spiritually. We are not talking about physically because you can save up all the food you want. If you don't keep the commandment, it's going to be vain. Okay? If you don't keep the commandment of the Mosai, you can stack up on the rice, you can stack up on your cereal, you can stack up on your, on your, or whatever, no do, whatever, guess what? If you are not keeping the commandment, it's going to be vain. So you got to make sure that you're keeping the commandment. That's what you got to worry about. In this time we're living right now, so many, listen, the Mosai have placed so many signs in the heaven throughout you. You see the conflict. There's conflict everywhere. Okay? China getting ready to take on war. On uh, on uh, on uh, on uh, 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 um, uh, Taiwan, okay. Keep in mind, North Korea is getting ready to to take on South Korea and, and Japan. Keep in mind, Russia is dealing with war. His neighbor, Ukraine. Okay, you see, USA fighting Russia, right, with the NATO, and the list goes on and on and on. You see, family, so many things. You got this going on. The is is a mount and disputable proof, Bible prophecy being. Like it's happening right now as we're speaking. When the next coming two months, you're gonna see the prices of your product. The product you used to buy when you go to your beloved store, whatever store you go to, your 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 beautiful Walmart, all this let guess what? Because we hearing that the farmers they're saying that diesel, the full diesel, the price is like way too up, and they say they can't produce because and guess what? They can't get they say they can't have access to war fertilizer. Right, those chemicals that they put in your food to give you cancer and disease, they say they can't have access to it. So they won't be able to produce the same amount of food they used to produce back in those days. Right? So you got to keep in mind, it's a lot. And guess what? Israel is plotting something again for you. Right? Get ready. Get ready in the spirit. Make sure you repent and you keep on the commandment. Because Israel literally telling you face to face. But our brother, they just watch things just for fun. No. He literally said 144,000. Really? Huh. Wow. Okay, let me go right here. Let's go to the book of Revelation 14. Let's go to go. Esau, they're the blasphemy. And there's no salvation for you. You can't blaspheme against the Messiah or the Holy Spirit. And you expect to be saved. You did, they, listen, there's no salvation for you. No, man. Let's read it. This is the book of Revelation chapter 14 and verses 1. And that's what we tell you. We're living in a, in a, in a, a very, very critical time. This is not the time to get distracted, to get carried away by nonsense and foolishness. You got to bury madness, right? Brother, you are not used to fasting. Maybe you need to start to learn. You got to learn after now we, the Feast of Unleavened Bread, we just finish it up, right? Some brother might be, listen, maybe you want to fast one day every week. Maybe you want to try to fast one day every week to build your spirit so you'll be able to fight off war, demons, You'll be able to fight because, listen, I tell you, man, I know I'm talking to you as a brother. I love you. I love my people based on experience, man. 
Some of these spirits, you cannot cast them off unless you're fasting and you're praying. Okay? If you used to pray one time a day, you got to increase it to two. Now, if you used to pray two times a day, you bring it up to three. If you used to pray three times a day, you can put it up to four. Okay? You can do it. Right? We can read in the book of a, 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 a song that David was praying like what? Seven times, or was it seven or five times a day? David. David was praying seven times a day. Seven times a day. Because the number seven is a complete number. The seven spirit, the seven churches, the seven region. Okay? The seven candlestick or the, the, the menorah. When you look at the menorah, you got a seven spirit which minister before the most high day and night. Seven day in a week. The seven is a complete number. Okay? The feast of Pentecost or the Shavuot or the Shavuot is seven complete Shabbat. Seven times seven is 49. And on the fifth year day, we'll be keeping what? The Feast of Pentecost. Some brother believe it's two days. Some brother say it's three days. Some brother say it's two, is one day, right? But usually I love to do it like two days, right? Because in a two-day feast, right? So keep in mind, Esau literally he's letting you know. Let us play a game, man. This is a short video, right? This is a very short video. You know, I think the Mosai, man. Because if it's not for the Mosai. Today, right? I'm announcing another $800 million to further augment Ukraine's ability to fight in the East. Uh huh. This, this package includes augment Ukraine's Let, he, to He's telling you, he said everything we're doing includes this. Augment Ukraine's ability to fight in the East. Uh huh. This uh huh. This package includes heavy artillery weapons, dozens of howitzers, and 144,000 rounds of ammunition. Wow, 144,000. Boom, he dropping. He said, mm, I'm going to tell you. All right, let's read it. He took it from the Bible. Because they're the top wicked nation. From all the nations, Esau, Edo, the fourth beast. They're the fourth beast. Daniel chapter 7 is talking about the fourth beast, Esau, Edo. Esau, Edo. And we're working on a project, Lord willing. The project within like a week or two weeks from now, Lord willing, the most allow us, we'll put our project outside and we're going to need brother help and brother to support us. Brother to support us in this work because we're doing everything we can to spread the gospel of the most high. Whatever tool the most high blessed us with, whatever wisdom the most high gave us, we're using it. All right? We're using it. Let's go right here. This is the book of Revelation, chapter 14 and verses 2. Actually, let read from verses 1. Revelation chapter 14 and verse 1. And I look and lo, a lamb stood on the Mount Zion. The lamb who are Mashiach. So him referring to 144,000, he is going against a Mashiach. Wake up, brother. How come he doesn't send 300,000 rounds of ammunition? How come he doesn't send 500,000 rounds of ammunition? And all the suddenly is the 144,000 as the most side set up that number. Satan using it too, man. Right? He said, well, he said, And I look, and lo, a lamb stood on the Mount Zion, and with him an hundred forty and four thousand. With who? With a Mashiach. Wake up. Understand this thing that these people plotting against you, Israel. Wake up, you Hebrew Israelite. You Hebrew Israelite. You Israelite. Based on your father, this message is to you. Wake up and share this video with your brother and your sister, your family. One. Hundred, this, this, Pharaoh is mentioning literally 144,000. In this 144,000, we're reading right here, they stood with who? Amashiach. With Amashiach, not with Caesar Bogier. So they're telling you, everything we're doing, the war we're waging against Russia is all about how we're going to destroy the Israelites. How do we destroy the Hebrew Israelites? How do we come against them? How does we gonna use the CIA, the FBI? We are gonna use the propaganda to demonize the Hebrew Israelites. And like I say, that's why we see some of you came out there in your in your video, or some of you making sound like, yeah, this group we are not affiliated with because you scared. You don't wanna go through persecution. Guess what? John the Baptist he was beheaded. Okay, keep in mind, Paul he went through he went through a bunch of hell. Forget about it, Peter. Don't even think about it. Okay, Jude, I'm a Shia who never sinned. You worry about you. I don't want to be hurt. And you want to be, guess what? You can't serve the Mosai. Listen, you can fast and pray all you want. Guess what? If the Mosai wants you to be beheaded, you're going to be beheaded. Keep in mind, there's nothing you couldn't do about it. Okay? Like I told you, a couple of weeks ago, when the government tried to set me up, like a couple of weeks ago, like around like two months ago, 
right? They contact me, secret agent, right? The government. I know he's either the CIA, the FBI, whatever you do. They were trying to set me up. They were trying to set me up. I didn't even freak out. I just respond to them literally through the spirit of the most say, how I was shy, man. Keep in mind, some of you, you don't want to go through persecution. You just want easy. Easy with the most I have not seen that yet. Jeremiah, he was put to death by our own people. He was stoned to death. Keep in mind. So doing this work for the most side, listen. Or you think you're going to hide behind your bodyguard? Does that protect you? No, it's not happening, buddy. Listen, the bodyguard will still be there in the most side. Move the spirit upon Esau or the heathen to behead you, to chop your finger up. So many things can happen to you. Okay? Understand that we can all serve the most side trying to save our life. And that's what we see from some of these can, not all of them, but some of these can, they got that, that kind of like narrative. They're making sound like they are not affiliated. They don't want no issue. They don't want no problem with no one. Right? No, man. That's not the spirit of the Most High. Listen, it doesn't matter how much you're going to please Esau. The Most High is going to move the spirit upon Esau. He's going to behead you. Believe me. I'm not joking. We listen to some of you sometimes. We'll be watching you. you be